Hey everybody, Insomni here. So, I was messing around with the Skyrim character editor because I started over on my character and I really didn't want to start completely over with absolutely nothing. I just wanted to do with quest lines over because I had forgotten how everything had gone because I hadn't played in a long time. But when Dragonborn came out, um, I decided to start playing it again and because I didn't want to start halfway through the game and like not know what was going on or where everything was at again, I decided I wanted to start over. So just wanted to show you guys how to use this and how to install it because it's very vague. I mean it doesn't tell you a whole hell of a lot. This information doesn't really help you because if you don't know how to create the save edit file, then it does you no good. So. We download this as the Nexus Mod Manager. Once it's downloaded, go ahead and install it. It'll be under Utilities if you've got the latest version of Nexus Mod Manager, which was 0 0.44.11. Um, once this is installed, this particular version I'm using is uh, 1.4. You're going to want to go ahead and go to your Skyrim data folder. Um, for Steam users, this is going to be under your Steam, Steam Apps, common section Skyrim and data and it's going to be called Skyrim character editor EN for English now I downloaded the English version there's also I do believe let's find out I think it was Italian yeah Italian and English I went all the way down here and downloaded the version 4 um, with mod manager obviously um, anyways back to here once we run this program it'll come up like this and you're going to want to pick everything that you want. Um, now, if you go through here and you grab all your skills you want. So, like, see, I want to have my light armor maxed out. And I want to have my smithing maxed out. And my sneak maxed out. And my speech maxed out. And my enchanting maxed out and my archery maxed out. Now I had all of these maxed out on my main character which is level 73 um, but I really don't want to feel like investing the hours and hours and hours and hours and hours leveling these skills so I can spend that time questing instead essentially starting off like I did. So I'm gonna go ahead and go over here. By the way you have to check box the ones that you want to be changed or else it won't work. Uh, other, I just kept it at level one for now because, yeah, I don't really care. Race aspect name, gold, let's see. Let's give ourselves some gold, shall we? We'll give ourselves over 9,000. Um, you can give yourself dragon souls if you want to go hunt down all of the words again, but since I've pretty much collect them all. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to give myself all the shouts. And add. There you go. You just control, you can use a control click to pick individual ones, or you can click and drag, and then click add button. That, that works too. Um, once you've got everything that you want, you want to create the file. This file is going to be saved to your desktop. So we're going to go to the desktop and grab that file real quick. Um, we'll do it from here. Desktop. And you know what? We're going to go ahead and do item type. Text file. Save. Edit. And we're going to want to copy this. Control C. And then you're going to want to paste it into your Skyrim common folder. Our programs for Steam users, it's going to be wherever your Steam is installed under Steam Apps. So we're going to go Steam, then you're going to find Steam App folder, then you're going to find the Common folder, then you're going to find the Skyrim folder. And then under the Skyrim folder, we're going to paste it in here. Now I already have mine in here. I'm just going to paste it, override it, because I did add one thing with my archery. And then we're going to head back to Skyrim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we are. We we'll check our levels. It'll be like level one or two or something like that. So exit, stamina, create. Yeah, there you go, level two. And if you notice, 
None of my stuff has changed yet because we still have to run a command. All this stuff is what you pretty much start with. So, exit that. You're gonna use your little axe key left of the one. Save dot edit file. So save or save underscore edit, excuse me. And that's going to run all Go ahead and exit out of that. Check our skills again. We now have 100 smithing, 100 enchanting, we got 100 speech, 100 snake, and light armor, and of course archery, which is my favorite. And uh, since I don't have perk points to use, I, I can't add anything into these, but now that I know that, I can go back and add perk points if I wanted to. So uh, let's go ahead and exit. Inventory. Now you notice I got the 9,000 gold that I had added, but we need other skills, items, let's see, shouts, perks. Enchanting, here we go. Go ahead and get all the enchanting, add to add list, destruction, alteration, all the speech because I'm level 100, sneak, all the sneak stuff. And where is it? Okay. All the light armor. Smithing and all the archery. I think that's all of them that I chose. Yeah, there we go. And then we'll go ahead and resave this. Go ahead and grab it again. Copy. And we'll go ahead and repaste it in here. And then we'll rerun the file. And this should give me all my perks. There you go. Now I have all my perks. Alright. 